Also breaking overnight, a man climbed a pole, then just refused to come down, and that forced the trolley to shut down just off Lemon Grove Way. Ten News reporter Diana Alviar live at that scene. Diana, so the man is saying he had a good reason to climb that pole? He sure did, but he was more of a danger to himself than anything. Now consider, he said that he'd been beaten up by some unidentified people, that they were waiting for him, and so he had to get up a pole for his own safety. Now this place is not safe by any means. Consider the fact that you've got live train tracks right here with trolleys running back and forth, and then you have the live wires directly above him. It happened just before 1 a.m. Police arrived to find him holding onto that pole. His face was all bloody. He was missing his shirt, his shoes, and his foot was hurt. He said he'd been beaten up and he was just too afraid to come down, kept shouting that they were waiting for him. Well, deputies worked to get the man down, and at one point, one of the officers had to climb up to talk to him. And of course, while all this happened, all trolley traffic had to be stopped to the surprise and frustration of passengers who were essentially trapped on that particular car. Now, eventually, the man did come down, and they ended up handcuffing him for his own safety. They determined that his story didn't quite hold up and that he needed some treatment, so they took him to a hospital to get checked out. As for the trolley traffic, that resumed, and everything seems to be back to normal. Live in Lemon Grove, Diane Alviar, 10 News.